Yan Amugella in Ubiniami bumped Abaga dad bumped Abaga coco bumped Abaga auntie bumped Abaga sissy. I am Sims and it's at the right Sims on Instagram. Follow your sister. Please, guys, one day I want to be 10,000 by March on my birthday. Please. Yes, I know I'm wearing my wedding dress. I ha It almost didn't happen, so I have to wear it. And I paid a lot. Yo, I, I had to wear it, guys. Are we going to talk about all the scams that we have joined? All the investments we thought we were making, thinking we were bright. <laughs> Woo. Mina, Mina, I have a lot to say about this topic. Yeah, but if Neverland was a person, we're not gonna say any names, but if Neverland was a person, but on, guys, do you know, Gukhore, I even lost my husband. I almost never got married because of Triple M. Because of Triple M. Okay, this is my honor rock. My in-laws bought me this. Ne? Because I, I didn't have a veil. I was wearing this Zulu hat. Let's make like... Ding, ding, di, di. Oh, ding, ding, di, di. Ah, di. That's how I want to walk down the aisle when I do a white wedding. Ding, ding, di, di. Ah, ding, ding, di. Ah, I'm joking. Okay, guys, so... In 2017... I had just gotten a job called UJ. And then, so, you no, know, it was 2016. It was 2016. Right? Okay. So, that Triple M thing was at its height. Like, Triple M was the investment to make. Triple M was a force to be reckoned with. Triple M was a thing to put your money in. I myself, ne? I went to my husband running. He wasn't my husband at the time I was running. Babe, I found this investment opportunity. You get your money triple. My husband was like, my husband can smell a scam from six meters away. My husband was like, it, it can never be. Financially, it, it doesn't make sense. I wonder what you're telling me. It's too good to be true. Don't put your money in there. He's like, Sims, don't put your money there. I was like, babe, you are so jealous. Why are you denying me the opportunity? He was like, nah. okay, with your money, play with it, not with mine. Mine don't. Yours, play with it, my darling. Ha. The good sis, I put 200 the first time. And the valley, next week Friday, no doubt I got 600 back. I was like, oh, this thing is the truth. And then I went to take a loan i borrowed money to go and put got triple m five thousand rands to put got triple m did i see my fifteen thousand return did i see my return i called the other people nami everyone was cry crying crying and then i was like okay fine Triple M was a bust. Then now we have to pay for things for my wedding to come alive. Where's the money? I have now 5,000 rents call out and it's with interest this time. I tried to keep quiet about it but eventually I had to tell the man, Hori, yo, now keep broke. Keep broke, ka capital letter B. Because of a mess. Oh, he was livid. Temping, booming, raging. But we worked through it. Mamo! Guys, pause. <laughs> Guys, my mother in law just saw me in this office like, ha ha ha. Aye. You've lost it. You've lost it. <laughs> she does not understand the things I do for my channel. You know? Kanji, where was I? Oh, yeah, I, was, I told you about my Triple M scam. Then I joined Long Ridge. Mina, I mean, I'm sorry, I would repeat Mina. <laughs> no, guys, it's just juice. I don't mix business with pleasure. When we talk about money, I don't make a mistake. But from Long Ridge, I went along. Long Ridge scammed me. That's my daughter, if you see her. Long Ridge scammed me. Or I, or I, I didn't put enough work in. I don't know. 
with long reach i'm still trying to find out if it's a scam or i just didn't put like enough work in the recruiting you know once they say i just feel like it's a pyramid scheme when they say recruit three people then those three people must recruit three people then those ha ah, it's like this it's a pyramid scheme so i didn't have the time or the energy to recruit people i barely sold stuff because i was like but where's my money though like where are the checks though where are them checks where are you guys cutting them friday checks because y'all said every friday we're getting paid though where's my money I ain't never seen one rand go long reach. I've been selling, I've been putting money in. I ain't never seen one dime of my investment. Unless, oh, I did sell some, but that's like return on investment. But not fully because I would buy stock and then we'd end up using it because no one wanted to buy it and I'd never recruited anyone. So with long reach, I don't know if I was scammed or I just played mafia, you know? Can you guys just tell me your stories down below? Were you ever scammed? Were you ever played? What was the worst investment you've ever made? Mina, those were the two worst that I can think of. Besides borrowing people money and them never paying me back. Besides me studying a business as a loan shark and never seeing people pay me back. The intra it's huh. Yeah. Tomorrow we wrap everything up because it's Friday. Thank you so much for watching Latin. I just want to sit here and marinate on the worst decisions that I've ever made because wow.